Let's get into the eclipse forecast, though. We are talking about that. We're wishing for some much clear skies on Monday. That's not going to be the case, though. But we want to talk about the forecast for the solar eclipse on Monday. Upper 70s as we head toward 1 p.m. in the afternoon. We are looking at some breezy conditions as well with those southeast winds at 10 to 20. And we're going to have that mix of high and maybe some lower clouds around as well. So here's how things may shape up. Now we will have some showers down along the Gulf Coast. Those will be creeping northward through the day. And you can see as we head toward that 1 p.m. We're going to be looking at mainly dry conditions. You see a less than 20% coverage with any rain that we could see. The clouds, though, will be increasing through the day. So we're going to have partly to probably mostly cloudy skies. We'll have some higher clouds across the area mixed in with some low clouds trying to creep in from the south. So we'll see how far north those get as we we head toward um, Monday afternoon, but after that, the showers do start to move in as we head toward 10 p.m. The rain and thunderstorms become more likely for us across the area Monday night. So the bulk of the rain, probably all of the rain will be after the eclipse is over and then we'll have some widespread showers and storms and maybe rounds of showers and storms as we get into late Tuesday or late Monday heading into Tuesday. More widespread rain across the area. Some of that rain could be heavy and we'll have that potential for some strong, maybe severe storms during that time as well. So you can see a large area Monday evening going into Tuesday that does include all of North and Central Texas. We'll kind of fine tune that and pinpoint the areas where we could see some strong and severe storms beginning late Monday right through Tuesday. So keep checking back as we make updates to the forecast. In the meantime, though, we're looking at clear skies. It's pleasant heading out this morning. 53 degrees at DBU. We'll have those mid upper 50s as you head out to McKinney at 58 57 in Greenville right now and some low mid 50s. What's the hatchy heading over to Granberry right now at 55. Those highs today will warm into the lower 80s, so it is going to be nice and warm out there today. Maybe some upper 80s over the western parts of North Texas. Not as warm as we get into the weekend. We are talking about a slight chance for some showers and thunderstorms late Saturday heading into early on Sunday. And that will be some showers and storms probably after midnight during the early overnight. That's going to be about it. Beyond that, the weekend not looking too bad for us. We'll have some upper 70s on Saturday and Sunday with plenty of sunny skies as we wrap up the weekend. And as we look at that extended forecast for you, heading on into the next uh, several days there, we will have that potential for some more storms down the road. As we head into the early part of next week, we will be looking at some temperatures in the low mid 70s right through the middle of next.